Hi, my name is Jose. And I'm Matt. And today we're going to show you how to rebuild your oil pump on a Sea-Doo four-stroke. Matt, what are some of the tools that we need for this? Well, we have our ratchet, our Torx bit, as well as our water pump shaft installation tool. And then we have our primary oil pump kit here, which we have the gasket. Uh, we have the outer rotor, the inner rotor, as well as the oil seal, and the water pump seal. And then for our secondary pump, we have our outer rotor, our inner rotor, our oil filter, and then our O-ring that we are gonna need. Okay, to start with, we're gonna go ahead and install the uh, shaft, which we can see that it has notches on it to indic indicate which direction it's gonna go in. Um, this it goes into the counterbalance shaft here. So th this side is going to go into the pump first. Then we're going to look at our outer rotor and we're going to look for the same notch that was on the oil pump which actually went face in. So we're going to make sure that our rotor goes in, our outer rotor goes in that same direction. Then we're going to put our cover plate on. And then we're just going to bolt that on. I just want to do it in a crisscross pattern here. And once we have all the bolts on, we actually have the O-rings that we're going to put onto the cover, which as you can see, this is already formed for this. And it just fits into the cover like that before you bolt it on. Then we have the oil filter and the O-ring and these will actually go on the oil fill cap on this side and the filter will go in this location and then your O-ring will actually go into the oil fill cap uh, section here that bolts onto the front oil separator here. Now for the primary oil pump which the first thing we're going to install is our oil filter, which is actually directional. You can see that it's thinner on one side and then thicker on the bottom. So the thinner side is going to go in first, which is going to go in this location on the pump. Then the first thing we're going to do is install our oil seal, which goes on the other side of the oil pump. which will go on this location here. And once your oil seal is installed, then you have to press in your water seal and then press your shaft into the water seal. So we'll go ahead and do that. And then once the shaft is pressed in and your water seal is pressed in, then we're going to take our outer rotor and then we see the notch here, which the notches on that inner rotor are also facing in, uh, like the secondary. So we're going to go ahead and install that in this direction. Our primary oil co pump cover plate and we're going to install that.
And we're just going to put our bolts on it. And then you're also going to torque these to the service spec manual. Okay. And then our primary oil pump is done. Well guys, that's how you rebuild your primary and secondary oil pump on your CD4 stroke. For more videos like this, please visit our YouTube channel.